Good morning, Erin. St. Paul's School in Concord is creating a fund to provide financial assistance for victims of sexual misconduct at the school. School officials said the money will be available to alum for therapy even if a formal report was never filed. The school said it's also launching a program to speed up composition for abuse victims. The confidential process will use an independent arbitrator skipping potential court proceedings. School officials are investigating several allegations of sexual misconduct on campus, some dating back decades. Many came to light after a formal student was convicted in 2015 of sexually assaulting a classmate. Hirschfield was later named in a lawsuit that claimed the school did not do enough to protect students. He acknowledged that the arbitration program could help the school avoid future lawsuits. As Hirschfield prepares for his retirement on Friday a year earlier than originally planned, he is also reflecting on this time in his school's history. Attorney Roderick McLeish, who is representing seven people who have sued St. Paul's, had cautious praise for the policy in a written statement he sent to News 9. Reporting live here outside the St. Paul's School in Concord, New Hampshire, I'm Riley King for WMUR News 9. Aaron, back over to you.